Peter with Guitar Lessons here, and today I'm going to be talking about some licks that can bridge the gap between our pentatonic shapes. I'm going to be talking about the key of C sharp minor. So this is going to be my sixth string shape. My fifth string shape I'm going to be using down here at the fourth fret, and all, all the way up here an octave up at the sixteenth fret. Alright, let's get going. Here's the first one. So here I'm starting out from the 6th string root on the 9th and 11th fret on my 4th string, 9th and 11th fret on my 3rd string. Here for this 11th fret I'm going to be sliding up to the 13th fret and then sliding up again to the 16th fret. And now I'm going to be hitting the 13th fret with my 1st finger, 16th fret with my 3rd finger, move my 3rd finger up to the uh, 18th fret, and here I am in my 5th string position right up there. So there I just have ended on this little lick. Kind of just saying, hey, I'm finally here at the fifth string root. The second lick. I'm starting out at kind of the upper part of my 1-3-1-3 one, three, one, three slide scale. So I'm starting on the 12th fret on the second string, 14th, 12th, and 2nd, and 14th on the first string. Slide up, kind of just like that slide is. Now I'm going to slide up again, all the way up here to the 15th to 19th fret right there. And now here I am finally in the correct kind of fingering position and everything of my fifth string way up here. So I'm just going to walk down that scale, add a little bit of a curl on that uh, second string, 17th fret, and then end on the 18th fret on the third string. The next lick, I'm going to be moving from my fifth string root up to my sixth string root. Now, here I'm starting out, if, here, if this is my kind of regular pentatonic shape, I'm starting out before that, my 1-3-1-3 one, three, one, three slide. I'm going to be going second fret, slide up from my fourth to sixth on the fourth string, and now I'm going to be going fourth to sixth on my third string. Here, my third finger is going to be kind of bridging that gap right there, sliding up to the ninth fret, sliding up again to the eleventh fret, where I kind of immediately go to a bend. So it's going to be on the third string, sixth fret, ninth fret, eleventh fret, bend up, go to the ninth fret. Here I am finally in my sixth string position, do a little curl up, and then end on the root, eleventh fret on the, on the fourth string. Lastly, I'm starting again from my 5th string root up to my 6th string. Here I am on the 7th fret, 2nd string, giving that a full bend up, and then down, and then 5th fret on the 2nd uh, string, 6th fret on the 3rd on the string. I'm going to be climbing up, 5th, 7th, 9th, kind of just like my 1-3-1-3 one, three, one, three slide. Then be 7th, 9th on the 1st uh, string, and then I'm going to slide up to the 12th fret, and then immediately go to a bend again and end on that ninth fret right there. So there I am in my sixth string position. All right, all together. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave them in the comment section below. Be sure to check out GearsGuitarLessons.com for a PDF tab of everything I covered today. More information on the pentatonic scales, maybe some different positions to play them in or some other things to add into it, um, and other free lessons and resources, even backing tracks to jam over. Uh, please like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you guys next time.